most commercial applications today do require some type of controls. In this case, we have an open plan office with nine, nine luminaires. And if you install the system without any type of control, a con conventional fluorescent system without any control, you can see that the initial cost is going to be quite a bit lower. But if you do compare the LED system with controls with a comparable fluorescent system that also uses dimming control, you can see that the, uh, that the, that the cost, initial cost difference is, is, is very close. And that's mainly due to the reduced cost of the equipment and the labor to install the controls initially. If you bring that down to operating costs, then you can see that this, that the fluorescent system with no controls is very unfavorable in, 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 this, in this comparison. And in terms of uh, increased energy cost and cost to replace the lamps. The performance of the fluorescent system with controls is really quite a bit better because the lamp life is, is going to be extended and reduced energy consumption. But this really comparison really weighs heavily in favor of the LED system with controls because of the additional energy savings and then the uh, absence of, of, of lamp change outs and lamp maintenance. So if you total all that up uh, at the end, um, what you see is that all three systems end up coming out very close. The fluorescent system with no controls, uh, in terms of total owning costs over a 15-year life cycle, is high because of the annual energy and, uh, and lamp maintenance costs. The fluorescent with control system is, 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 is high, higher because of the initial cost, but has improved operating costs. And then the LED with controls actually comes in very close to the fluorescent in terms of installed cost, but has a, a great benefit in terms of energy performance and lamp maintenance. So overall, the total cost of ownership for the LED is superior.